uh, Jim Walton. Uh, uh, he's a former city manager. I mean, just a, a, a very disciplined public speaker, very disciplined. Um, uh, uh, Mr. Harold Moss, uh, Mr. Lyle Quasim, and, uh, and uh, pastors, I probably would say uh, uh, Pastor Banks. He's, he, there's a term uh, that we use uh, for preachers that know how to manipulate a manuscript, and Pastor Banks has perfected that. And so, uh, 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 eating a manuscript, you know, so I mean, you ate it, and so once you have digested it, there's a flow with it, you know, and so, um, and so, um, Trying to think of uh, so there are several pastors that I really admire. You know, if if I had to go with the uh, some of those that are more uh, well known, uh, I I like T.D. Jake style. Mm -hmm. I like uh, Cleflo Dollar. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, and I like Charles Stanley. T.D. Yeah. Jakes, which probably my style is closer to. There's a lot of teaching in the preaching. Mm -hmm. A lot of teaching in the preaching. So you're just not you know, what we call hooping or climaxing is, is probably the, is the text, textbook term. But, but in the African-American community, we call it hooping, you know. And so, so, so T.D. Jakes does a lot of teaching prior to his hooping. Uh, Cliff Low Dollar is just a teacher with a lot of climax. There's no hooping. It's just a climax. And, and Charles Stanley is just a straight up, teacher. And so I kind of admire all three of them.